Rideau Hall may be quiet now, but soon employees will be talking to outside investigators about what it's like to work inside these walls. Sixteen sources now accuse the Governor General Julie Payette of belittling, berating and publicly humiliating employees. Multiple sources, including former employees, say they're relieved the Privy Council office is hiring a third party for an external review. They want to be part of it after staying silent so long. Pyatt's second-in-command and longtime friend, Asunta De Lorenzo, is also accused of bullying and calling employees lazy and incompetent. These stories are extremely saddening. It's very important that anyone who has experienced harassment in the workplace in that setting or any other setting needs to be fully able to tell their story. Canada's employment minister said the independent review should include as many current and past employees as possible. I would absolutely encourage them to be incredibly broad. One workplace harassment expert says the problems at Rideau Hall shouldn't have gone on this long and shows the complaint system is flawed. An organization like this of this caliber should have a long time ago evaluated how they could improve their process. Sources said concerns to HR and the Ombudsman all circled back to De Lorenzo and went nowhere. These harassment claims span the past three years, Payette's entire mandate. That could make this review complex and lengthy. In a tweet last night, the Governor General said she takes workplace harassment issues very seriously and not only welcomes the review, but says she requested it. Ashley Burke, CBC News, Ottawa.